Hey there, you might not remember me, but we've already met. You know, my life's become so boring recently. All I do is sit at home. Nobody needs a mascot anymore. So, I decided to have some tea and a chat with you. What tea do you prefer? Huh? Is that… Oh, I think I've come up with a much more interesting thing to do. If you don't recognize this, it's a portal controller I found some time ago. Shall we? Here I am, in the middle of nowhere. Where is everyone? This place looks so… deserted. Hello? Anybody there? Hmm. Looks like no one's living here any longer. Let's take a look at that building over there. I really don't want to touch this door, but how else do I find out what's happened? Oh my, there's dust everywhere. People have clearly abandoned this place long ago. Hey, what's this? A letter? Oh, let me see. To whoever reads this, these are my last words before I'm gone. Before we all are. The day has finally come. They're gathering everyone in the city center for evacuation. We're going to leave Earth and settle on a huge spaceship. It'll take us to a distant planet somewhere in the Andromeda galaxy. They say it's not safe here anymore. I'm scared, but hopeful. Perhaps we'll find a new home there. If you're reading this, you're probably late for the ship. Please light the beacon I've left in the drawer. They'll come for you too, I promise. Wish you all the best. Wow, the beacon, they said? Here it is. Don't mind if I do. Nothing's happening. Broken, perhaps. No, wait. What's that noise? It's a spacecraft? We've seen your signal. Come out with your hands up and no harm will come to you. Oh, jeez. I better go now. And what in the world is going on here? Why is that guy running from the cops? And what's that guy doing on the roof? Is he jumping? No, wait, don't do that. Huh? He just sprung off the ground and ran away. Uh, Hydra! Um, and that little girl is toting something very dangerous looking, and it's way too heavy for her to lift so easily. Oh no, that car's going to hit her. But no, she just pointed the muzzle of that huge thing under her feet and flew away on the blast. Huh. I think I'm losing my mind right now. Hey, will you please be more careful? I'm standing here, you know? Uh, yeah, sorry, I didn't mean to be rude. You know, I don't like it here anyway, so I'll just… bye! Okay, this place looks much more civilized. Although it's kind of weird. That huge rock wall over there seems inhabited by real big birds. And they're wearing business suits. Huh? Okay, am I standing on your home? I'm so terribly sorry. Let me repair it. Okay, good as new. Um, excuse me for asking, but are you guys meerkats? Yeah, thought so. Why is the ground shaking? Uh-oh. Wait, those are buffalo. And they're all wearing t-shirts and caps. And they're chasing a human on a motorbike? It's the human run. Centuries old tradition. Oh, I didn't hear you approaching. Of course you didn't. I'm a cat after all. Yeah, sorry. So, you were saying? It's a traditional race between buffalo and humans. After it, they'll all celebrate together. But right now, I advise you to get out of their path. You don't need to ask me twice. Thanks, and bye! My eyes! It's so bright here! Oh, okay, I can see a bit now. Everything's in yellow and just a bit of black. Hey, that's… that's me over there. And there too! <laughs> I'm everywhere. Well, not exactly me, but that, that's clearly my symbol. <laughs> I think I know where I am. Let's go explore that airplane-shaped building. Hmm, it's too dark here. Huh? Where's the door? It's just been here. Oh, I'm trapped. 
Help! Oh, three doors have appeared instead. Let's check them out. Ow! This one's too hot to the touch. And the second one is covered with hoarfrost. It must be really cold behind it. What about the third? Ow! I didn't even touch it, but the spark hit me already. I guess I'll have to choose one to leave safely. Is that a timer ticking? Why is everything suddenly turning gray? Hey, wait! 10 seconds isn't enough? What do I do? Aha! Gotcha! There's the pause button. Whew! Now I got time. Ooh, this jacket looks warm enough to get me through the second door. Still cold, though. And? Uh, guys, um, why are you kneeling? Are these your gifts? To me? Hey, you know, it's cool and all, but I'd rather go. And you remember, always stay on the bright side of life. Wow, would you look at that? This city seems to be built as tall as it is wide. Hey, there's a flying taxi. And that guy looks exactly like Corbin Dallas. All right, I want to look at it from above. Hey, give me a lift, will you? Thanks, my man. To the top level, please. Yikes, that was fast. Here you go, keep the change. What a view. So, this is a city of the future then. Metal and glass towers, air highways. Looks wonderful to me. Oh, look, it's that same taxi again. But now, there are three unfriendly looking fellas filing out of it. And there's nobody here but me. Uh oh, I must have done something wrong. Sorry, guys, I'd love to stay longer, but I have business elsewhere. Now, this world looks similar, but somehow different at the same time. What does that say? Planet Express? Ah, I know who I'm gonna meet here. Let's go, we might just see the whole team. Or not. The Starship is leaving the dock. Some parcel to deliver, no doubt. Ah, well, anyway, there are plenty of other worlds to explore. Am I back on the original Earth? Whoa, look up in the sky. It's a bird. No, it's a plane. It's a whole lot of flying people. Ouch, now that was some gust of wind. Wait, was that a person too? It seems this world is full of real life superheroes. Let's have a look at where they're all headed. Oh, I better not get any closer. There's something crazy going on up ahead. Ow! That blast nearly took my bulb off. Hey, who are you? Where are you taking me? I'm afraid of heights. So, you gonna leave me on the roof like that and just fly off? Okay, I guess this superhero isn't a talkative type. Well, whatever. This place looks very familiar. I think I… Oh goodness, this can't be. But it is! Look at that banner! I don't recognize the face or name. But that guy is definitely of my kind. This is my home world, and even the street where I was born. Everything here's changed, though. I can barely recognize this place. Oh, jeez. That's my parents' house. I'll just take a sneak peek. No, it isn't them. I don't know these bulbs. I guess too much time has passed since I was taken. Sorry, I can't bear it any longer. Let's move on. Hey, light bulbs can't swim. Huh? But we can float. Alright, I'm fine. Why is there water all around here anyway? Hmm. Wow! Just below me is a whole city, all built underwater, and there are people swimming around. Ah! Oh, just look at that seahorse carriage. Oh, hey, buddy. Sorry, I don't understand what you're saying. I heard dolphins were smart, but probably not enough to understand speech. Ow! What was that for? Are… are these your friends? Hey pal, I'm not looking for trouble, okay? I'm just visiting. No, don't touch this thing. It'll… transport me to another parallel world. Great. Ah, it somehow took me back to Earth. Well, I guess it's enough to mention traveling for one day. Why are all these worlds so hostile anyways? So, 
As far as I can remember, I wanted some tea. Here's to you, Brightsider.